Hello and welcome back to the Man United fans stand and the Manchester United 2 Perth Glory nil. Um, well, uh, an interesting game. Um, well, in the first half, it was uh, rather interesting uh, from a Manchester United perspective. No goals, but it was entertaining. Uh, we put a lot of pressure on uh, Perth Glory, in my opinion. Uh, yeah, the weather has changed. It's now nice and sunny again so yeah I mean in, look, in my opinion I thought um, the Perth Glory were a little in, look, in my opinion they seemed uh, really under pressure uh, really under pressure the pressure that uh, we uh, put Perth Glory under um, I mean it, it, it was too near it, it could have easily been about 6 nil to be honest for you 6-7 it, it it really could have been more in my opinion but at the end of the day it's pre-season we are back it's not really a massive concern that you know that that we didn't get the goals that we should because look, if we play like that in the Premier League um, we, we um, the, 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 look we played pretty really well as a team but we need to be a lot more uh, consistent on on goal in my opinion 100% uh, we look, we really do uh, but at the end of the day look, look, we're back in pre-season we're back playing football and that's our first game as a team in about uh, two two months, let's say. So, at the end of the day, look, 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 look we haven't played as a Manchester United team uh, uh, for quite a long time, though, have we? So, um, I mean, look, at the end of the day, it's it's it, it was interesting to see Manchester United back, um, and you know, I'm I, 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 I'm happy to see us. Uh, come back and play again because it, it's good to see uh, Manchester United just have a whole game to themselves. I mean, look, we put a load of pressure on them. In my opinion, it was uh, a really good game uh, that Manchester United played. A really good game of football from us. I thought uh, we totally dominated it. I mean, but, but can anyone name me any any opportunity that they had that was danger? They put us um, under no danger whatsoever. I think, you know, look, we... Look, we're really good at winning the ball back in certain areas. In my opinion, Wabasaka was absolutely class. Daniel James was class. So that's good that our two brand new signings are on their game here um, in pre season. Um, and I'm, I am happy with it. So, you know, um, it's, it's, it's going to be interesting to see what's going to happen in the future for them. Um, the goal scorers were Marcus Rashford and James Garner. Uh, James Garner is like his first touch of the game. It was an excellent goal by Garner, uh, just outside the box. Rashford, um, I think it was Pogba that assisted it. Uh, I mean, both goals were from really poor defending, but I think it's also because we put a lot of pressure on them, though, um, as well. I thought they got quite nervous, and it, it, it wasn't just from the goals. It's um, it was the whole match we kept on putting pressure on them, and that's what I noticed ever since Solly and Solskjaer really came in. Um, I mean, l l look, we've been putting more pressure on them since Jose Mourinho's left and Oli and Solskjaer came in. We've been putting a lot more pressure um, on the sides, like uh, trying to win the ball back in certain positions, and we were uh, winning it back at about the halfway line where they tried to come in. I thought uh, we played absolutely amazing. I mean. Um, in, in the first half, I don't even think they got into the box. In the second half, I thought we let them through a little bit more, but that's the half where we scored the most goals. I thought uh, they're both entertaining halves. The first half was entertaining, even though there wasn't any goals. I mean, it was en it was entertaining from a Manchester United uh, perspective because, you know, it, in my opinion, it, it, it's great to see uh, Manchester United uh, just dominating a game, and that's the reason why I really do like pre-season. Apparently, um, well, it, it was a massive stadium and it had great atmosphere. Apparently, um, there were peop um, people around from 41 countries. Um, uh, went, they all went to Australia to go and watch that game. I don't think it was sold out, but it's a massive, massive stadium. And we be told, and we be totally sold out um, as Manchester United fans. I'm proud of the side, but still. It doesn't mean that we're going to be... It, it doesn't mean that that's going to suddenly hand us over the league. Hand us top four. It's, it, it's not going to do that. that. That win and the way we played amazing is not going to make any effect on next season whatsoever. 
it, it, it's, it's not going to make an effect. I mean, it, it doesn't affect us if we finish last. I mean, look, look I don't believe we'll finish last. I'm 100% sure that that won't happen. But look, I mean, look, there is a chance, but I'm, I'm very sure it won't. But at the end of the day, um, nice to see United play again, uh, playing well with, with a 2 0 victory. And yeah, two, uh, both of our two new signings, Daniel James and Ryan Basaka, absolutely world class, um, as we saw from them today. So I'm happy with what's going on. Um, I'm Manchester United that pre season. Bring on Leeds in our next game in pre-season. We're playing at the exact same stadium, so I'm excited for it. So, but but, but before I end the video, my man of the match is either got to Wan uh, go to Wan uh, uh, Daniel James. To be honest with you, he's got to go to one of them. I thought they both played absolutely amazing. I mean, it's hard to say because um, it, it, it was just the one half team, though, wasn't it? One half Daniel James is playing, one half Wan Bissaka was playing. So. You know, and it's like, yeah, we switched the teams around at half time, so that's why in pre season it's hard to choose them out of the match. But all I'm saying is, I'm giving credit to both of our two signings today, um, Daniel James and Wamba Saka. Hopefully, we can get a few more signings. So, yeah, um, anyway, what a win today. Let's keep playing like that, P putting pressure on sides, and yeah, we can. Uh, and then we can go further in pre season and let's try and take it to the season. None of this affects on next season, though. None of it. That win does not affect next season. But, you know, hopefully we can take some of this to next season, though. That is what we need to do. All we can do is take it to next season. So, yeah, and, and then that's what can affect. So, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching if you of the Man United fans, and I'll speak to you all soon. Anyway, thanks for watching.